Well, um, almost everybody here looks like uh, my vintage, and I kind of thought I might have some people here who have been playing the guitar for a year or two, but I think we might have scared them off. I don't know. Uh, our idea here was to both play some tunes, but also kind of talk about some things that, um, that players can do, no matter how long they've been playing, that will help you become uh, a better player. And uh, most of what these things are is things that I discovered uh, by accident, because I went for a long time without a real guitar teacher. Uh, I had uh, an accordion teacher. And uh, so I learned how to play the accordion, and I had an uncle who knew about four or five chords. So with those two things, I started poking around until I kind of figured out what was going on. And in the process, I think I stumbled onto some things that are kind of uh, helpful, you know, for somebody at any level to get better. Um, but I love the sound, so I think I was going to try it out a little bit here, play a couple tunes. This first one I was going to play is uh, Blue Finger. This is a tune that uh, Jerry Reed wrote, and he wrote it one day in Chet Atkins' office when Chet was on the phone. And Jerry's over in the corner just messing around. And um, Jerry didn't know it, but Chet had the record button on his cassette player. And uh, I learned it from Chet. And then years later, I thought, well, I'll play Bluefinger for Jerry and see what the deal is, you know. And um, Jerry said, well, what's that? And I said, well, that's Bluefinger. He said, never heard it. And he didn't even remember doing it. And so if Chet hadn't hit the record button that day, there would be no Bluefinger, you know. So, blue finger. <laughs> 